The President's Award was created to honor individuals of all styles who have made special and significant contributions to music and the music industry. Tonight's recipient was the first full-time performing rights representative in the South to sign writers and publishers of country, folk, and rhythm and blues. By ensuring that these creators got paid, our honoree was also a catalyst to the explosion of Southern music, indeed American music. May I present BMI's President Emeritus, Francis Williams Preston. There are some gentlemen with us tonight who came especially to honor you. First, ladies and gentlemen, I would like to bring up Randy. Randy Owen. Francis, I remember the time that you gave the call to my home and you said, Randy, do you need some money? And I said, sure. And you said, uh, I said, well, I've been wanting all my career to build my wife a new home. And you said, um, I could advance you enough money to build your new home. And my wife is with me tonight. And luckily for me, there's a lot more money came along than enough to build a new home. And I'll never forget you. And whatever path that you take, please take me with you. I would like now to invite up Vince, Vince Gill. One thing a lot of people don't know about Francis and I, we have been great friends for a long, long time. Should I go ahead and tell him now? It's tonight the night. 1984, Farm Aid, the first Farm Aid. Um, we were both checking into the hotel at the same time, and uh, they only had one room left. We were roomies. But uh, out of all the things that, uh, that I've accomplished, uh, writing songs and being uh, recognized for them has meant more than anything. And uh, it's been said that Conway Twitty was the best friend a song ever had. I think we'd all be remiss if we didn't admit that uh, Francis Preston was the best friend a songwriter ever had. God bless you. And now, if I could invite up the next inductee to the Country Music Hall of Fame, Chris Christofferson. She listened to us, and she loaned money to us, <laughs> and she respected us. And, and that's, that's something you might not understand as much today. But back when I came here to town, the songwriters <laughs> We're at the bottom of the food chain. But, but, the, but the perception has changed because Francis fought for us. And uh, personally, I think of her every day because I get to look at the little rocking chair her daddy made, my, our oldest son. And uh, I just thank you for being a human being. And you, you were the right person at the right time. And really and truly, the applause that is given here tonight is really for the songwriters. So I say thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you.